How to be a submissive wife. Today's tip is navigating Facebook as a submissive wife. Today I want to discuss the impact of social media, particularly Facebook on our lives and relationships. It's important to remember that Facebook should be a space for sharing positivity with our friends and family and not a platform for negative commentary about our marriage and family or friends. It's important to remember that Facebook should be a space for sharing positivity with our friends and family and not a platform for negative commentary about our marriage, family or friends. Let's explore how we can navigate Facebook with grace and discretion, focusing on the power of positive posts and avoiding unnecessary involvement in conflicts and comparisons. As a submissive wife, it's crucial to be aware of the influence that social media like Facebook can have on our well-being and relationships. Facebook allows us to connect and share our lives with loved ones, and it's important to approach it with mindfulness and positivity. When faced with the temptation to comment negatively about our marriage, family or friends, let's divert our energy towards more constructive avenues for discussion. Engaging in public online arguments can often escalate conflicts and harm our relationships. Instead, prioritise open and respectful communication with your husband, family members or friends in order to address concerns and find productive solutions. In the age of social media, it's easy to fall into the trap of comparing our lives to others' carefully curated posts. However, it's important to remember that social media often portrays a highlight reel which doesn't reflect the full reality of people's lives. The grass is not always greener on the other side of the fence. Focus on your own journey, count your blessings and find contentment in the uniqueness of your life. Let's strive to uplift and inspire others when interacting on social media instead of criticising. Share positive moments, achievements and acts of kindness contributing to a virtual environment of encouragement and support. By doing so, we harness the power of social media for good. Additionally, it's crucial to consider our own well-being in this context. It may be best to refrain from posting altogether if you find yourself without anything positive to say. Instead, use the platform as an opportunity to seek and spread joy, gratitude and love while celebrating the achievements of our loved ones. The conclusion of today's podcast is... As a submissive wife navigating the world of Facebook, remember that it should be a space of sharing positivity with friends and family. Avoid posting negative comments about your marriage, family or friends, and focus instead on cultivating an environment of digital positivity. Avoid unnecessary involvement in conflicts and comparisons, always reminding yourself that the grass is not always greener on the other side of the fence. By remembering this mindset, you can navigate Facebook gracefully, fostering and uplifting supportive online and offline interactions. May your journey as a submissive wife be marked by the power of positive posts and the joy of sharing your blessings with others. I hope these daily tips will help you become the submissive wife you want to be in a marriage filled with love and happiness. If you desire additional assistance on becoming a submissive wife or wish to buy me a coffee and support my mission to foster happier marriages, kindly visit howtobeasubmissivewife.com. Thank you for listening.